This is Chicago's very own WGN News at 9. In tonight's Medical Watch, it's painful, prevalent, and in many cases persistent without surgery. But now one stitch can save some people a world of pain. It's a new procedure designed to relieve acid reflux in just 20 minutes. Sometimes it's so severe that in the middle of the night, if I don't sit up, sit up when I have this reflux, I'll throw up. Jeff Fieser is one of 15 million people who suffer as acid backs up from the stomach into the esophagus. The condition can lead to esophageal cancer. Well, I was looking for something that would permanently take care of the acid reflux. Gastroesophageal reflux disease, or GERD, is caused by a loosening of the sphincter muscle at the base of the esophagus. This is the gastroesophageal junction, and this is the muscle which is weak. So what you Medication do is, is often like used to treat bacteria. GERD, but it just Turn reduces around. acid. It doesn't it's correct the problem. That's, That's where the plicator the comes muscle. in. What plicator does it, it grabs, folds, and put, um, put the tissue together in a way that you can recreate the barrier, what you are born with, so the reflux goes away. It goes away when doctors add a stitch. First, the plicator device is inserted into the stomach. Then the jaws are opened. This is the stitch we put out. And this holds the muscle together. This stitch with these two plagets. The proof of success is in the patient. Wonderful. I can do uh, you know, a lot more things than I could do before, and I can even eat pizza. So I says, it's, it's great. I says, also too, I says, my asthma seems to be, you know, a little bit better too, because it was very simple. I'm just very sorry I never did it sooner than I did, because I was afraid of, you know, side effects or anything, but this has no side effects whatsoever. Studies show at least 75% of patients get total relief after the plicator procedure, allowing them to stop taking prescription heartburn medications. On the Medical Watch, Dina Baer, WGN.